there. So, if you don't know, um, Japan is one of the major manufacturers of Haagen Dazs ice cream, and their manufacturing plant is or plant. Their manufacturing place, I don't know what you want to call it, plant, building, location, is happens to be in Guma. So as a result, we get all of the experimental flavors and new flavors before the rest of the country or the rest of the world. And today I got one that I've never heard of before. It comes with a cute little spoon. It's this flavor. Uh, it's rose hips and raspberry. I have never heard of rose hips before. <laughs> never. So we're gonna take my cute little Hagen Dazs. Oh my gosh, it's a literal, it's a literal Hagen Dazs spoon. Can you see this? <laughs> I don't know if you can see this, but it literally says Hagen Dazs in the spoon. <laughs> I thought they were just giving me this regular plastic spoon. I didn't know there was like a special spoon. Anyway, let's try this. Never heard of rose hips. Heard of raspberries. This is what it looks like. Alright, so let's take my tiny spoon. Interesting. It like tastes like how um, perfume smells with a raspberry flavor in it. <laughs> It doesn't smell. You know you have like flower perfume from Bath and Body Works? It tastes like that smells. And then like the strip, the this part is just raspberry. I really don't know what I think of it. I keep eating it. I guess it means I like it. Either that or it's just because I'm really craving ice cream. Yeah, I have no idea what I think of it. It's just the most strange flavor I've ever experienced. Anyway, I'll finish that. But if you think of anything that you'd like me to try in Japan, or if I find any new Hagen Dots flavors, I'll let you know and I'll try them. And if you think of something you want me to see me try, as long as it's not chocolate, then we're okay. So, thanks. <laughs>